Hello, I'm Chris with Atlantic Drain. This is one of several relief methods used to prevent water in the basement, the concrete channel drain. This method consists of drilling weep holes in the cinder blocks just above the concrete level, cutting a channel drain to remove the water to a sump pit where the water is then pumped to a drain line outside the basement wall. Dimple board and concrete are then placed over the channel drain. This creates a maintenance free enclosed system. The tools used to cut the concrete are a variable depth concrete saw, a 2x4 and a 1x4 which are used as guides for cutting nice straight lines in the concrete. The overall width of the channel will be three and a half inches. And the depth of the channel will maintain a minimum of one and one quarter inches. The inner and outer walls of the channel are being cut as well as a line right down the middle of the channel. The concrete is then removed using a two inch chisel attached to a Bosch hammer drill. A weep hole is drilled into each cavity of the cinder blocks where the wall meets the floor using a half inch drill motor and a half inch masonry bit. A sump pit must be dug and installed at the lowest point of the basement floor. Uh, since I installed the sump pit, Once the sump pit is installed Perform a fresh water wash down of all work areas while clearing out all rubble and debris from the channel check the flow from the channel to the sump pit. Dimple board is then cut and placed across the channel and up the wall over the weep holes. The dimple board should be cut to fit a minimum of two inches up the wall and two inches beyond the outer lip of the channel drain. Crease the dimple board as so it will seat against the wall and floor extending properly over your channel drain. Cut and dry fit all dimple board pieces across the entire length of the new channel drain system. A 100 square foot roll of DMX1 dimple board can be purchased on eBay. Now mix up some quickcrete or sackcrete concrete mix place the concrete mix on top of the dimple board periodically checking the seating of the dimple board up against the wall once you have your dimple board covered with concrete use a concrete trowel to evenly spread the concrete and create a smooth finish for completing the enclosure of the concrete channel drain system. It's the nature of the beast. Well, it's been raining for the last 48 hours and it's still raining. We're going to go in here and check out how the system's operating. One final check. Looks dry as can be. I hear the sump pump cycling. So the sump pump's working.
system's operating very well. Water's just pouring into the pit. It rained here about 48 hours ago. And now the system's picking up the water and transferring it into the pit. And that sump pump, it's about to cycle. It removes it from the pit to the piping outside the wall. I'm Chris with Atlantic Drain, reminding you, it's easy once you know how.